This is the first time I've done this on camera, so it feels a little awkward. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was so going to go live, but I got nervous. I was saying, oh my God, what if this thing messes up live? I might as well go embarrass myself live, right? But I figured this way, I can just talk to you guys at the same time. Feels like we're together. Uh, now I use my handy dandy concealer, if you can see that. Literally, okay, look. Don't go in the corner of your eye yet. Remember, you're not putting it in those creases. And I'm doing it with my finger because I'm doing a very quick face. And I want you guys to forgive my voice. I get hoarse a lot. Um, and I was with my family. And if anybody here on here knows my family then you guys know see i take that very little bit the last piece of um concealer on that eye that's when i push up on my eye but i don't I don't use tons of concealer under my eye because when you're over 30 ladies your eyes will always look better when they have no makeup on because we start to get fine lines and those fine lines are literally um, ex almost exaggerated when we put on concealer. So you always wanna like make sure you don't cake it up right there, okay? And what I like to do, I do like to set it, I use um, taffeta, like the, this is the pressed powder so you just, I use the color taffeta because that's the color I also use with my, um, with the Unique Concealer. And I literally this is like my everyday face, okay? It really, really doesn't take a long time. It takes like maybe 10 to 15 minutes about the whole thing if I'm not sitting here and showing you and all this other stuff but it only takes like 10 or 15 minutes then you want to get um my I use the unique pressed powder and I use this in the color cypress I don't know if you can see that I use cypress and you, you want to use a contour brush so it's like that flat you see what I'm trying to say okay and then you just dab it excess okay I just make a quick little line on both sides now when you're doing contour the one thing you don't want to do you don't want to bring it in all the way you want to stop your contour right here the end of your eyebrow okay and with contour you never want to go down you always want to go up so when I'm blending I'm blending that up. See that? Blending up. See that? And for my nose, I literally make the line. I make the other line. And if you have a round nose, the way I do, see my nose is round, it's not pointy and thin and fine. If you have a round nose, do not make that circle. 
You know how like you see women make that circle on top? You don't want to do that. That's for people who have fine, thin noses and they're trying to actually make it more round. So you don't want to do that. What you want to do is take your brush and contour the nostrils, okay? And you want to make it like that, all right? Because what that's going to do is it's simply shaping out what's already round, okay? And then we buff this out right here, right into the eyebrow. We buff it out into the eyebrow. Buff this side into the eyebrow. Into the eyebrow. Okay. Into the eyebrow. Into the eyebrow. And you want to make sure that you don't have all this um, sharpness. Let me just, this is hard to do on. Anytime I feel like I have a harsh line, I'm telling you right now, your fingers are like the best blender ever, okay? But look at that nose. Yes, girl. I got a bridge now. Mm-hmm. All right. Yes. I'm just going to put on these eyebrows real quick and then I'll come back because this is way too hard to do on camera. So I'm going to just get a mirror and I'm making sure I buy one because I'm going to go live for you guys. But me just put them on and I'll be back. I wanted to show you guys um, this comes in the actual kit and they're 20% um, off. OK, they are 20% off in July. So I promise you. Not only will you get a discount on all of your makeup, but you actually get a discount on the kit and can start your business, girl, right now for 20% off. But um, I'm actually going to do a cut crease with this, okay? So if you got hooded eyes, um, what are hooded eyes? Hooded eyes are simply that our, you see the skin on my eye? The skin on my eye is low. So anybody who has this kind of eyelid, hooded eyes, you want to do a cut crease to really show like the actual makeup look because if I put my makeup where I'm supposed to put the crease, when I open my eyes, I'm looking down at this camera, but if I go like this and I open my eyes, where that is, you won't be able to see. You won't be able to see it. So I'm going to show you guys. So I'm going to use um, everything that's in this palette. So I'm going to start with the darkest color, okay? And this is just like I said. You can have an everyday look with this. Look at that. That's such a gorgeous purple. Oh my God. This is gorgeous. This is the first time I'm doing makeup on my computer. So bear with me. Ooh, that's nice and dark and purple. If anybody knows me. You know, I love the purple. Bring on the purple. Give me the purple. The people want the purple. The people want the purple. The people want the purple. Okay. Listen, I haven't seen you guys in a while. I miss you, man. I should have did this live. I really should have. So this is the purple. Look how purple pretty that is and this whole palette is like a mauve palette which i love it because these colors go with anything so you let they're like really natural colors so you can do like any look with these things and i know right now every makeup artist is looking at me and saying maggie are you kidding me why are you windshield wiping these things because i'm showing them how to do a 10 minute face girls okay first of all I will say, I'll be the first one to say, I am not a professional makeup artist. I don't claim to be. I love to do makeup. Can I hook a face up? Yes, absolutely. But I do not claim to be a makeup artist, okay? So as I'm doing that, I'm going to get a different brush because this brush is dirty now. I'm going to get a different brush and I'm going to go in with this color, okay? And I'm going to use it as um, what they call a transitional color. Okay, I'm going to just go right there and right beneath it. And the reason I'm doing this, I know, believe me, I know you guys are like, Maggie, you look crazy. What are you doing? 
Are you insane, Maggie? You're just piling colors onto your face. What are you, crazy girl? I'm telling you, I know what I'm doing. I'm telling you, I'm not a big And if anything, that is what makeup wipes are for. Okay? All right. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you ladies how to cut a crease. I forgot to get my concealer brush. Give me one second. Okay, and I'm back. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to take the same um, uh, concealer, right? Mine is taffeta. Put a dot of that on. And what you're going to do, I'm going to get really close to this right now. So, y'all about to know me like you never have before, okay? Because we're going to work it out. So, I took, um, this is just uh, the Unique Concealer Brush, okay? And it's nice and flat, and that's what you want. You can use any brush. I really, really like this one. It's flat. It's um really rough, like uh, what's sturdy on the end, so it has precision. So you just dip this, okay, little dot. Now what you want to do, I'm going to show you the trick right now, okay? Ready? So I'm going to put a little dot, a little dot on my eye, all right? What you want to do is you're going to look straight up. And when I looked up, you saw how that dot came out? This is where I'm cutting it. Okay? If I would have, my real crease, see that? See the real crease? If I would have stopped my makeup there, you wouldn't have seen anything. But when I cut the crease here, you're able to see everything. So let's cut this bad boy. Ready? What you want to do is you want to work your way. I'm sorry, I can't I can't talk and do this. You want to work your way down. Okay, so here we go. I like to do half cut crease, so a whole a whole cut crease you just do the whole way but I'm just gonna show you the half cut crease okay this is really really hard to do on on camera but we're gonna work it out we are going to work And you literally just go over it with concealer. Do you see that? Do you see the difference even in both of my eyes? I haven't even finished it yet. I literally, I'm using a dot of this stuff, okay? Oh, yeah. All right. I'm going to do the other one off camera. Okay. Okay. They are both cut. Okay. And now I'm just going to go in again with some of this purple. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. This is pretty, pretty. 
And now on top of, one second. And then I'm going to actually on the concealer part, I'm going to put on this beautiful like white, looks like, um, I think it's called Angel Dust. I have to look at the color. I actually took it out of the, the thing. But I'm going to pack on to my brush. And you literally just pack that on really pretty. Oh, that looks so pretty. You guys see that? The pretty color. That's such a pretty color. I haven't blended it yet, so don't go easy on me. Don't start saying Maggie then lost her mind with all this white stuff on her eyes. Oh, that's very pretty. I started off saying this was going to be... Um, a daytime look, and now it's just looking real glam. Really nice. Oh, this is really pretty. And now I didn't dump, like I didn't put this back in. I'm literally just blending, blending the two together so that you don't have any of those like really harsh lines. And you have a really pretty transition. You know what I mean? I'm also going to take this white, use this brush again. This time I'm gonna tap off the excess and I'm just gonna apply right up here. I have not um, done my eyebrows yet. These things, ugh, they're like so Oh my God, guys, I'm really trying to talk and do this. And this is difficult. I cannot do this. I cannot talk and do this. Um, But yeah, you just put some of that white on the top of it. And then I'm going to take some of this purple and even out over here. And just do it right underneath the waterline. You don't want to do it on the waterline, under the waterline, okay? Go under the waterline, and this is just a small, um, it's like a blending brush that comes on the end of an angled brush. This is what I use for my eyebrows, so it's like a two-in-one. And I'll link everything down below if you like any of this stuff. Guys, this is over $300 worth of makeup, and you get it for $99 with the kit. This month in July... You actually get this, all of this stuff, for $79. So I'm telling you, it's a steal. Whether you want to start a business or be a, what we call a kidnapper, and that's simply just buy the kit for the awesome makeup that's in it and um, just get discounts on your own makeup. You know what I mean? Okay. Okay, we're looking good. Looking good. Okay. I'm going to put on some liner. I don't know if I could do this with you guys. I I don't think I can. <laughs> All right, put a little bit of blush. Also, I know 
people have, I know my grandma brought me up the way she's like, smile. And she says, you know, for you to smile and do that, don't do that. Because if I do this, when I don't smile, it's not in the same place. So you actually want to do your blush not smiling, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Because you always want it in the right place, okay? So, and you want to put it right on top of that contour and give yourself a little bit of rosiness, okay? Lastly, I will use, hmm, which one do I want to use? Do I want to use 4D or the Epic? Let's go with 4D today. We'll go with 4D. They both come in the kit, by the way. So it doesn't matter if you want to use either one, you can. They both come in the kit. And I love the mascara. As usual, you guys know. I'm so sorry. I'm losing my voice. But as you guys know, their mascara, they're known for their mascara. Unique is known for their mascara. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. This mascara is the truth. It really is. And the best thing about it is that it's buildable. So when you're doing it, you can, like, literally, if you want them longer, you can go once. If you want them longer, go twice. Doesn't really matter because it's buildable, you know? And you want to go like a zigzag to get that thing really nice. And in there, you know what I mean? So, go up, 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 and then you want to swiggle, swiggle, up, 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 swiggle, swiggle. And it's really awesome. This is a really, really good mascara. If anybody needs to get this on auto ship, then I'm going to tell you now that it's worth it. Um, I believe it's every three months. You can get it auto shipped to you, and you don't ever have to worry about running out of mascara again. Okay, so that is about it. Um, I can do some lips, but I really don't. One second. And so here is the splash, and this color is what color did I get this in? This comes in the kit too. Um. Oh, here we go. I can't see that but anyway it comes in the kit it's a really pretty color and it's like a nude really 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 pretty it stays on all day long and it's creamy enough but it's matte it dries on matte which is great because it's not like cakey and sticky it actually like goes on really good I'm just gonna line my lips real quick and then I'll put this on Okay, put this real quick. Mm-hmm. It's so buttery. It's so pretty. And a little bit goes a long way. And that's it. That's a full face. So I love you guys. All this is in the kit. You can um, do it all. I, oh, the foundation is not. However, we are having a sale, but I'll tell you guys about that later and I'll go live. I love you all and I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye.